what's up y'all welcome back to my channel man we, we'll pull up uh um two more topics man you know i, I had a I had one episode where i did uh one topic and it, it went it went a little while you know so i like to keep y'all on because i talk fast and mumble and all this other stuff but i want y'all to catch what i'm putting out you know what i'm saying so uh one existence i want to just touch into real quick um before i just get on my lighter the lighter mode uh was uh was just this whole thing and it just kind of brings me to kind of all this Jama, ja Morant um, situation and these different situations that athletes and celebrities face. But you got Patrick Mahomes, um, per, per TMZ, Patrick Mahomes, bro, Jackson under investigation for sexual assault in Kansas. Uh, all right, so we on, uh, I'm Patrick Mahomes. I'm making millions and trillions, not, not, not trillions, but millions of dollars, multiple multi millions of dollars i got i got a stake in a baseball team i got i'm doing all these good things i just won the super bowl but my little brother can't stop getting out the public eye so all that stuff is alleged but i'm gonna read the article from tmc and i'll tell you i'll just forefront it i don't from what i see from his little brother i think he like just he just a coattail rider um that's my opinion, though. You know what I mean? I could have, you know, I could have it, but you know, you probably got more money than me. Um, but a coattail rider, a coattail riding his brother. He's trying to use that celebrity as a, as a, and he's just, he's just, he's just doing stuff like it does not make his little brother look good. I, I haven't seen any smut on his brother's name, Patrick Mahomes. I'm talking about with his little brother. Seems to be always in the new. I don't even know what this dude do. What does he do? What does he do besides me and Patrick Mahomes, brother? Anyway, article reads, Patrick Mahomes' little brother, Jackson, is in the crosshairs of a criminal investigation in Kansas for alleged sexual assault, which appears to have been caught on tape. First of all, scumbag, if you um, sexually assault somebody, um, period, or you forcing yourself on somebody, period, that doesn't want your advances, and uh, if the per especially if the person expresses that, and... This makes me sick, you know what I'm saying? Um, I seen the video. It could be a wobbler, could be a questionable thing, but all I see is is is. And if you read the story, it seems like this woman is married, and, and her, her husband is is part owner of the club or something. We'll just break that down later, but uh, unpack that later. But it's like, why would a woman want? you honor her in the club or a bar or whatever it is that her and her husband own or whatever it is but or they could see his cameras or whatnot so it don't look too promising and you know what i'm saying like i'm not the judge jury or whatever it is but if it's if it's true that's foul like like um i don't condone that at all you know what i'm saying i got daughters you know what i'm saying i don't even if i if i, if I didn't have daughter, i got kids Period. You don't force yourself on somebody that don't want them on you. Period. So, Patrick Mahomes' little brother Jackson is in the crosshairs of criminal. Okay, we got that all. According to the Kansas City Star, police looking into claims made by restaurant owner in the area that, as well. Sorry, man. You know, I got this screenshot, so every time I clip, it covers up what I'm reading. So, that's the breakup. Police are, police are looking into claims. Made by the restaurant owner that the area, as well as one of the waiters, were alleging Jackson Bolt. Jackson Bolt sexually assaulted and physically assaulted the la them last weekend at the Aspen's restaurant and lounge. The owner, 40-year-old Aspen Vaughn, which is probably the female, provided KCS and cops with surveillance footage, she says, yep, was captured last Saturday when the alleged assault happened. In the clip, you can see a man... Um, she says is Jackson wrap her in her arms for and forcibly kiss her it doesn't happen once by the way you see the man going for a kiss at least twice see mom says she believed Jackson was intoxicated but nonetheless his advances were unwelcome which she said she made clear to him in the moment earlier same that or that same night one of Vaughn's waitstaff claims Jackson shoved him out of a private room he was 
dining in with an entourage this after the waiter smelled weed and tried to get them to stop the waiter alleges jackson and his crew shoved this guy and told him to scram apparent first of all um, that's that's one thing tell him to scram i don't i don't i don't know who said scram anymore anyway apparently jackson frequently frequents this place a lot and knows the owner's stepdaughter at least that's what they're saying but this in the case she claimed he crossed several lines. Vaughn says she and her hubby kicked Jackson out. So her husband, husband is in there. Kicked Jackson out and his friends, I don't know if that's a, their co-owner. And his friends out alleged forcible kiss and that cops were called shortly thereafter. As far as we know, Jackson hasn't been arrested yet. But his attorney has spoken out and defended his client saying he is innocent. His lawyer, Brandon Davies, said Jackson has done nothing wrong or our investigation has revealed substantial evidence that refuting the claims of Jackson's accuser, including them, the statements of several witnesses. We have statements of several witnesses. We have reached out of, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. We have, yep, statements of several witnesses. We have reached out to enforcement to provide the fruit of an investigation so that they may not have complete the picture of the matter. They may not have the complete picture of the matter. So, sorry, that was a, that was a struggle. I gotta figure out how to um, do this better. So I maybe get a teleprompter or something, I don't know. Shoot. The Kansas City Star, Jackson is under investigation for the alleged sexual, oh, uh, there we go. Skip. The Kansas City Star says, Jackson is under investigation for alleged sexual assault of this woman, but not the alleged assault of the waiter. It is unclear the waiter is gonna press charges, but Vaughn says the cops already told her they're pursuing the alleged kiss without with out or without they, they meant to put kiss without but they put or without so kiss with or without her help that's what it's supposed to be and she says and she says they're going to cooperate in their pro Jackson himself hasn't said anything publicly about this just yet ditto for Patrick all right, Patrick Mahomes hasn't said anything. So, and I wouldn't say anything, uh, Patrick Mahomes. I don't know, but I don't have as much money as you. I don't have any star power as you. I don't. I'm not. I'm not a, a Super Bowl winning quarterback. I'm not the one in the spotlight. This is what I'm pissed off about. Whether this is true or not, legend or not, why, why, little brother or not, young or not, I don't care. Why are you doing crash dummy shit? Excuse my language. Just, just. Knowing what your brother is doing for you and your family, you know what I'm saying? Knowing what your brother is doing, like if my brother is 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 as an NFL star, making millions of dollars, putting our family, building generational wealth, taking me wherever I'm going, I'm going to the Super Bowl, I'm going to all these different parties, things like that. Like I'm done doing and living life. I don't even need to do anything anymore. My brother got me. If that's the case, why? Why are you in Kansas? So I'm pretty sure they're not from Kansas, but um, I think there's some, they gotta be somewhere from Texas, I believe, because he went to Texas Tech, Patrick Mahomes did. So now you're in Kansas, more than likely because your brother. Uh, why are we doing all this stuff? To put light on my name, my family, ruin what, what I got going on. And then on top of that, Regardless, if you weren't famous or not, why are you forcing yourself on females? Allegedly, you know what I'm saying? So, ah, man, it just, it just boiled my blood. Like, 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 well, when we gonna get it? You know what I'm saying? When we gonna get it? Like, like, if I'm doing something that is detrimental to my brother's or my family's name, that, that, that's putting bread on the table, you know what I'm saying? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna be out the way. I'm just, or I'm just not gonna do it. I'm gonna think twice about it, young or not. You know what I'm saying? I was like, hey, I mean, maybe it's maybe it's there's some some training need to be done. Maybe he's ignorant because I might have been ignorant to it back then too. And I'm like, why is this affecting my brother? It's me. I did this. No, I'm not hearing none of that. He's not even making a statement. He got lawyers and stuff. I'm like, come on, oh man, it's it's it just drives me crazy, man. You know we gotta do better. We gotta do better, man. Shout out Patrick Mahone. Um, as a Raider fan, shout out, shout out to you and your success. 
man, just, I don't know, you probably had this talk with your brother several times, but man, I don't know, if you ain't got no father figure or some kind of mentor or something, you gotta be that one uh, at this point. Yeah, sometimes you you enable, you know, enable folks, man. Uh, no, but uh, you gotta cut him off. And like I said, um, cut him off and like be serious. Like, hey, I'm about to cut you off if this don't stop, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying you did it. I believe you. If you didn't do it, cool, whatever. Can't happen again. Can't happen again. You know what I'm saying? Now you're talking about our family. You know, you got you got a kid. You got you got a wife. You know, fiance, whatever. I don't know. Um, but I know you have some kind of girl and the baby and stuff. So um, shh. you got you got to figure that out. You know what I'm saying? And we we got to stop doing this as a people, man. We got to stop doing this to our family, man. You know what I'm saying? Just because they doing all right, um, we, we just we just go do something, drag them down, or we, 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 we don't know we doing it, but we doing it. So we gotta we just gotta think think before we move, move better. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> yeah. I don't know. Kinda of boils my blood though, but yeah, let me know in the comments what y'all think about this situation. Um even if you don't you don't care because I mean who who cares? Why why is it doing important? But who cares? But you know again, somebody mom, somebody somebody wife, somebody somebody's Somebody's um, sister, you know, they they affected by this. You know what I'm saying? So they, they don't deserve that. I don't, I don't even know why you go up to somebody unless you just know them like that to just try to like force yourself upon them and like, allegedly. But the, the video don't look don't, the video don't look too cool, you know, in his defense. But man, let's just just get it right, man. Let's get it right, y'all. For real. Uh, I don't know if this can touch anybody. You know what I'm saying? and get them to move a little different but if it does touch one person i'm cool with it you know what i'm saying but anyway talk to y'all later man make sure y'all be safe be good to each other man you know do better you know what i'm saying lonely poop here lonely d mac inglewood though